Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Carolyn. I just wanted to pop on today and talk a little bit about why I'm doing another Disney college program. So I have on my magical castle embroidery cast member quarter zip to get me in the mood. So let's go. So I did a Disney college program in the spring of 2022. It was right before um, my final semester of college. So I had a semester, my first semester of my senior year. I did the Disney college program. Now I'm doing finishing up the second semester of my senior year and I'm going back and doing another Disney college program. I did apply for full-time and part-time positions. Technically I'm still in the running for a couple of them. So maybe but the whole reason i'm doing another disney college program and it sounds really stupid is to get my foot back in disney's door so disney has lots of opportunities and lots of roles and just lots of in general opportunities the problem is those opportunities are not always available outside the company Disney really likes to hire and promote from within. They like you to move around to different roles. So once you're inside the company, it's actually really easy, comparatively easy to move around and get where you want to go. Problem is getting in Disney's door is not necessarily an easy task. They post very few things externally um, they post a lot of housekeeping externally, a lot of like lifeguard positions externally, but things like resort concierge and attractions and merchandise, they don't necessarily post, post a lot for those, if you know what I mean. So, because I do want to end up at Disney long term, all I want to do through this college program is get my foot back in the door, not even with this college program. My whole goal of applying to Disney again was to get my foot back in the door. It just so happens that the college program is largely the easiest way to do that. Once you've done a college program, a lot of door, even if you don't stay with the company, a lot of doors open for you that wouldn't necessarily have been open for you before you've done a college program, but a lot of opportunities exist for you on the college program that don't exist, you know, applying externally. You get access to the entire internal job network at Disney by doing the Disney college program. And yes, it is a comparatively low level internship, but it is a Disney internship. And I, I know technically it's a low level position, but just because it's down here on the food chain ladder does not mean it is not a high intensity job. Basically, yeah, we just spent four minutes rambling about how the whole reason I'm doing another Disney college program is I want to work for Disney long term. And the Disney college program is the easiest way to get your foot in the door of a company that once inside the doors, you can go anywhere and everywhere. I'm like, you can go to California, you can go to Paris, you can go to Shanghai or Hong Kong not Tokyo, because Tokyo is technically owned by the Oriental Land Company. You can go to Hawaii. I don't know where I just went with that statement, but yeah, basically I'm doing another Disney college program to see what doors at Disney open for me now that I can actually potentially accept opportunities. I couldn't accept them on my first program because I knew I had to come back to school and finish my degree. And so now, I'm intrigued to see where those doors lead me and, you know, what potential opportunities may come my way. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed watching. I will keep you posted on everything I get about the Disney College program. We're gonna be doing another role reveal video. We're gonna be doing another location video. I'm just gonna, we're gonna do what we did last time and I'm just gonna give you all the details. But yeah, I hope you all enjoyed watching. I hope you all are getting excited for me to move back to Disney World and I will see y'all again real soon.